Let's take another look at bone split. What I've got here is I've got one bone selected in the tail that really should have been a few bones because of the, the curve in the tail. I'm gonna go, gonna go ahead and open up bone split and the number of new bones, let's go ahead and use three. I think three will be fine for the tail uh, area that we wanna fill in. And instead of the default setting, let's use spline interpolation. And what that's gonna do is it's going to take the parent bone and the child bone and in between it's gonna interpolate a curve. So let's, let's go ahead and click okay and it's placed bones along that curve. So I didn't have to go in and manually adjust them with the joint mover. 